Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's time for another unboxing and today we're going to be going over March's Mystery Tackle Box Elite. And I've already opened this one up and I'll have to say I think they've hit another home run this month. I've been receiving Mystery Tackle Box Elite since last November and I'll have to say so far I've been thoroughly uh, impressed with all the uh, boxes I've received so far. And I'd also like to encourage everyone, if uh, you like this type of content, and I'll leave a link up above, to uh, check out uh, my video series that I'm doing, a year-long comparison between Mystery Tackle Box Elite versus Monster Bass. And I'm sure if you like these unboxing videos, you'll love that video series too, and I really encourage everyone to check that out. And as always, I'd like to start off by telling everyone that I really appreciate everyone watching these videos. And if you like this type of content, by all means, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, leave some comments down below. It really means a lot to me. And with that being said, let's roll that intro and dig right into this month's box.
Okay guys, uh, we're just going to kind of go over each bait a little more in depth and uh, we'll just start going down the list. This is the bait card that they included that has all the uh, prices and uh, I've already double checked these and uh, all of these prices were pretty much spot on uh, this month. We'll start off with uh, the first bait was the Evergreen Custom Jerk Bait. And uh, this is a nice looking uh, jerk bait. And uh, I'm very interested uh, in these because this is something that I'm going to try to start using more of this year. I've never uh, really got into a hard jerk bait fishing. And uh, I said one of my goals this year is to kind of start using baits that I'm not comfortable with. And uh, this is a very, very good looking bait. Three and three eighths inches long, five sixteenths of an ounce, and it dives three to five feet. So I'm, I'm definitely uh, going to look forward to getting this one out and trying it. And it retails for $15.99. Then next we have the uh, Guggen Squad Clickbait. And I've ordered a few of these, haven't had a chance to uh, fish with them yet. This is in the uh, Sexy Shad color. And I, like I said, I haven't been able to get out and fish with these yet. But just looking at it, I'm going to say it's going to be a great bait. Uh, as far as chatter baits go, I usually use, uh, I've only got a few because they're so expensive, is the uh, Z-Man Jackhammers, and, and I love them. And I know uh, these have got a lot of uh, positive reviews, so I, I'm anxious to get this out on the water and uh, see how it does compared to a Jackhammer. And these retail for $8.99. Then next, we have the Bowspun Rattlebot. And I was actually tickled to death to uh, get one of these in this month's box. Because these actually, uh, they just released these just a few weeks ago. And uh, they were sold out in just a matter of days. And I actually got uh, two of these. But this is the Magma color. And I was actually wanting one of these, and they were sold out. So I, I was, uh, I was very pleased to, to get this one uh, in the box. And uh, this is just basically Biospawn's take on the tried and true uh, rattle trap, lipless crankbait. And uh, it's got a very unique design. And there's actually two different styles. This is actually a uh, crawl version and then they have a bait fish version and uh, there's some subtle differences between the two the uh, crawfish version has the eyes towards the back and the bait fish version will have the eyes towards the front and also a nice little subtle uh, difference is the rattle chambers this is the crawl version so it's I believe it's just one large ball bearing and it's got a little deeper thud and the uh, crawfish version has uh, several smaller ball bearings with a higher pitch sound of, I guess, more mimic uh, the sound of bait fish. So really looking forward to uh, trying these out and I was very happy that they included those in this uh, month's box. And they retail for $7.99. Then next we have uh, Ducket Baits BD Square Bill. And again, this is a good looking uh, square bill. This is the uh, 3.5 uh, size. It's uh, three quarters of an ounce, dives three to six feet. And uh, I will, there's a few. Uh, small reservoirs uh, that I fish that I will definitely be able to use this. Me, I prefer the smaller sizes like a 1.5 or a 2.5 uh, 
And uh, but I'm sure a lot of you guys that fish in big water, this is more your style. But again, I'll definitely get some use out of this. And definitely, it's got some sticky, uh, sharp hooks. Uh, says it comes equipped with katana hooks. And they seem very sharp. Then next, we have the uh, Lake Fork Live Magic Shad. Swim bait. And uh, I love this color. I love the uh, watermelon uh, on top. Pearl white belly. And uh, these actually uh, remind me of the Gary Yamamoto uh, Zaccos. And uh, so I, I use those as a trailer uh, on my chatter baits. So I'm sure that this will be an excellent uh, chatter bait trailer or any type of trailer. Or just rig it up a, a small uh, Texas rig. But. Uh, Looks like it's gonna have some great action, basically just like a Zacco. So again, that's another great bait they included this month. Then next, we have the uh, 10,000 fish Shimmer Shad. This is a unique uh, looking bait. The package is saying you can rig it uh, just like your classic uh, fluke weightless or with a, a weight a belly weighted uh, extra wide gap hook or uh, rig it as a drop shot i'm probably uh, i love fluke uh, fishing so i'm probably going to wind up rigging this uh, as a fluke and i don't know if it's showing up on camera but on the belly is clear and there's some silver excuse me silver foil on the inside and I mean it's it's extremely flashy and uh, I'll, I'll definitely probably be throwing this uh, as a fluke but it, it's pretty light so I'm gonna say I'll probably have to use a belly weighted uh, hook but uh, definitely looking forward to trying those out then next we have the uh, smart baits finesse worm and uh, if you're not familiar with smart baits, uh, their deal is uh, color changing uh, plastics. Not sure what this uh, color is going to change to, but right out of the package, it's this uh, watermelon uh, red. But again, a, a finesse worm. Fixing to be springtime. This is going to be a killer bait. Then we've got the uh, Gambler 3 inch Little Otter. Again, this is going to be another great bait. I love uh, beaver style baits. Uh, this would be great as a, either a jig trailer. Or me personally, these beaver style baits, I like putting them on a, uh, a swinging jig head. Uh, me personally, I use the uh, biffle head and I'll probably use this on it as a trail jig trailer and uh, it's a very good looking bait. And last, we have a, a three pack of four alt Eagle Claw laser sharp uh, extra wide gap hooks. So these I'll actually use because that's that's the size and style hook I use 90% of the time. So that was it for this month. Uh, like I said at the beginning, uh, I was very pleased, especially the Bog Spun uh, Rattlebot being that. Uh, they're basically uh, out of stock everywhere right now. Should be back in stock soon. So I, I'm really looking forward to uh, trying it out and the uh, evergreen uh, jerk bait. And uh, 
all in all, I think this was another great uh, box for Mystery Taco Box uh, Elite this month. And uh, been getting these since last November. And every one, in my opinion, has been excellent. And uh, with that being said, like always, I'd like to tell everyone, I really appreciate you watching, especially if you made it all the way to the end. It means a lot to me. And if you like this type of content, like I said at the beginning, please subscribe, hit that thumbs up, leave some comments down below. It really means a lot to me. And uh, like I said at the beginning also, I'll leave a link up above to the uh, video playlist uh, that I've uh, got of my year-long video series comparing Mystery Tackle Box Elite versus Monster Bass. If you like this type of content, I'm sure you're going to love that as well. And uh, really appreciate uh, everyone for watching. It means a lot. Keep coming back for more. And until next time, guys, keep those lines tight.